with your point. Um, I was just gonna say that, like, in the same, like, on the opposite side of the spectrum, as a single girl that does OF, guys completely discredit me the second they find out what I do, and I, I based, I, based. I know. I'm not. I'm not saying. I'm not in the point in my life where I'm like, oh yeah, I need. I need a boyfriend. I'm just saying like, it can be just as difficult on the other opposite side of the spectrum. So don't, don't put yourself down or compare yourself because if you compare yourself to other people, then it takes the gratification out of your own, your own success, your own happiness. Yes. It's not but worth it. Oh, that. You, you're very smart. I can tell. And do you, do you want to be a role model for other people? Ultimately, is that something that you'd like to be? Of course, and I believe that I can do both and it not be a degrading like yes. me not i'm not i'm not degrading myself by by i'm gonna get women are gonna Putting be sexual give me the rapper give me the rapper do you give think that here. you uh, we should rapper. have young girls looking up to no, like no, no, do you think no, no, the dream of a young give it. do you think that the dream of a young girl should rapper. be yep. give me the hey brian let me ask the question okay do you think that Right. Bro, she's like making noise with All right, we're done, we're done. Um, Elle, do you think that the dream of a young girl should be to be an OnlyFan? I think that a young woman should have a choice to do what she wants with her body and that it shouldn't be frowned upon to do whatever means necessary to be independent. And that's my opinion. And you don't have to agree with it and you don't have to agree with the way that I make my money and I, you reserve that right for yourself. And I respect that opinion. I do. I think it's powerful that you're allowed to have that opinion, but I don't think that I need to agree to it or co-sign it. But I think we all just had this conversation. Chase was talking about it, asking questions. I think we were kind of all most agreeing maybe not every single person but most of us were agreeing that you know porn has really hurt society at large and we wouldn't want to be in a relationship with a man who looked at porn a lot of men on only fans are fans are married men who are looking at the porn and their wife is you know they're being cheated on basically so I mean that role you, model that you want to be right, then, then it's men's job to step up and take the market away it's back to what I said earlier. Men have always led the world. Why are we going to act like it's women's fault now? If there was no platform for her to make this kind of money on, she wouldn't be doing it. If I men were better, point. she would be with a different man. It is men's job to take this responsibility and stop subscribing to it. Not the girl's fault because the girl has no man to get under and get behind and believe in. No man to marry. No man to be submissive to. And so the only thing that's out there is for her to make money with this easy way because he's weak ass fucking I mean, dudes. Okay, one thing all right, I, hold, hold, hold on. One, hold. one quick thing. One thing I really appreciate about. What you're saying, Justin, is that you're saying men need to take responsibility. Men should take responsibility which for I it, love. which I is not a new thing. It's always been this way. Agreed. So for us to flip it on the chicks now, I think is dumb. Agree, but I would just argue that women are strong. We have agency. We can make decisions. I agree with some of the language coming out of this side of the table that we make decisions, we make choices, and we should use that power for what end, right? It's not like men have all the power, women have no power of choice. Women have the power to decide the standards that we hold ourselves to and that we hold men to, and the kind of women we want to be, and the kind of role models we want to be for the next generation, right? How? And so I agree. So here's my question, <laughs> Justin. Do you think a woman? I want to hear what Elle has to say about yeah, that. Yeah, we can get to let, that. Let Chase speak. Justin, <laughs> do you think a woman is being a good role model by doing OnlyFans for the younger generations? No, I think she's doing what she has to do. Like I, I'm Does not. She I'm not have her. to do OnlyFans. No, no, though? she doesn't. No, she doesn't. But when she has the option of, of being a uh, look, and I'm not take it like. Taking up for OnlyFans girl is not on my agenda. Mm. But when you look at it, she's either going to go do a job where she makes no money or she makes $70,000 a month. Or I make less money than a man does doing the same job. I mean, same. she's... Yeah. Well, no, no, I, no, I disagree no, no. with that. I, de no. I, don't, I don't think there's... Wait, a wage, wage gap is BS, but th yeah. she makes six grand a month. She could find a job where she makes six grand a month. It's not like it's... And I, ha I have other jobs that, uh, that I've done before where I make way more than six grand a month, but that doesn't mean that I can't... So why would that, you stop doing I guess, and do this? I'm, I guess I'm basically I'm I'm just what, what my six point six is is that not so much to defend the OnlyFans girl, but to empower young men to be stronger, more capable. Mm -hmm. So a lot of these girls can find a man that they want to get behind instead of getting behind a screen and selling porn. That's